Hi, I'm John Green. <laughs> I Sorry. take coffee. I was Sorry. like, I don't. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> How read. many fingers? <laughs> I don't know because I can't do higher math, so I'm gonna have you answer me. <laughs> I know it's gonna be that way. Just strap in, okay? Keep your hands inside the ride, people. I'm here to try to help you get uh, up to speed on the Diviner series. It's only been going on for a decade. It's kind of like um, The Simpsons, but with less animation and uh, more murder. Someone asked if this was a grapefruit. Also, demons. You know, like you do. And if that isn't enough to get you in, well, I don't know what is, Missy. So there are all kinds of characters, and I feel like I, I want to help you out as much as possible. <clears throat> so I'm going to draw these characters for you. So there is Memphis Campbell. And he's a poet, you can tell, because he's holding a book of poetry. And uh, his younger brother, Isaiah, who is a seer, and you can tell that he's the younger brother because he's smaller. Listen, don't judge. This is what happens when you cut arts funding, okay? Uh, there is Evie O'Neill. She has a cloche hat. She's a flapper. Um, and then apparently she has no arms. She has arms in the book though, so. There is Henry, Henry Dubois, who is a piano player. Um, he also has a hat, but his hat has a backstory and it's a very sad backstory, so. Uh, happy hat, sad hat. And then there is Theda. Theda Knight, she is a Follies girl, so let's give her some spangles right here. Those, those are spangles. Uh, so we have Theda and her fire hands, which are like jazz hands, except um, it's like jazz hands, but I'm sorry about your drapes. And then last but not least, we have Ling Chang. Um, I'm gonna give Ling her favorite expression, which is like the annoyed emoji. Uh, she's annoyed all the time. I love her. So anyway, that's our cast right there. I'm sure you recognize them all. Oh, oh my gosh, how could I forget Sam? Sam, who is the pickpocket. But you know, it's kind of appropriate because Sam has the power to disappear. So look, now you see him. Now you don't. And last but not least, there is Jericho. He's very tall. I don't know what's, what's happening with his legs. <laughs> <laughs> Jericho. <laughs> Jericho's got to lay off the Radithor. That's what I have to say there. In the book, he's actually. <laughs> now, now he looks like a grumpy pumpkin. <laughs> just ruined my book for you. I'm so sorry. It took me a decade to write this series. Um, and instead what I did <clears throat> as something that looks like, like Slender Man on a diet. I was not loved as a child. Yeah, this is a book that uh, if you need to hold up a table and back. Judge is ready. Timer's ready. And scene. Naughty John. Naughty John does his work with his apron on. Yeah, he's not a chef, okay? What he's making, you don't want to eat, all right? I'm just saying, eyeball, femur. Eyeball, femur. Keep your spoons out. It's Naughty John, who is the spirit, the spirit? The spirit. It's, it's not just a spirit, it's a spirit. Yes, they face off against John Hobbs. The spirit of the notorious murderer. Eggs you want stage left. Intersecting, right? Mm. My mother, meanwhile, is back in Texas, and she's going to look at this and she's going to say, well, Liv, people are going to just think you're strange. I got through three sentences without saying something weird. So then we have book two, right? Because there's a book, it's, it's a series. <laughs> I know, it's like, there are four of them. There are four. I used to be so much taller, and I used to speak in complete sentences, but... <clears throat> I'm a broken husk of a woman, and that's why you should buy this series, okay? Oh my god, I had forgotten all of this happens. It sounds terrifying. Yes, Theta. <laughs> that sounds sad. Like, he went to a birthday party. He was like, oh, I put my gift down. I can't find my gift. I'm just, I feel like I have to have a visual for this. He looms over the nation, right? Okay, so let's just, I'm going to draw the nation, which is going to look kind of like this. 
So basically, it, it looks like um, it looks like your uncle's alcoholic liver. So, and here is the man in the stovepipe hat. Look, he's like the Babadook. <laughs> he's like the Babadook wearing a United States sweater. Oh! Again, arts funding is important, people. Uh, we are making record time. I. It took a lot longer to write. Stronger together. Um, that's Jake Marlowe because he's a jerk. Kind of like the guy who I will not mention who when I asked him to, if he would want to take me to the Sadie Hawkins dance when I was 16 said, Oh Libba, don't ask me that. I'm not bitter, Brian. Uh, wait. Now I'm confused by my own story. Just, you know, I mean, it's kind of like when you shove a shoe between worlds and you're like, wait, and then you're like, oh man, evil got in. Ah, oh, I fell for it again. Don't do that. Don't keep doorways between realms open so that, uh, so that the dead can come in. It's just, it's gauche. Well, if you'd read this series, you'd know. Puff, that is a sad moment. Um, this is what sadness looks like. Um, let me read that like a normal person might read it. Like, what more do you want from me? People, it's been a decade. I've been working on this for a decade. I drew you pictures. I drew you pictures. This is me working on the diviners, okay? This is me. I look, I look kind of like, um, those are supposed to be tears, but I really, I look like a grumpy peanut M&M. Um, or, a, or a very disgruntled mime. Bad things happen. I mean, I think you can pretty much figure that out. Uh, reintroduces shoulder pads, whatever you want to think. Who is trying to bring himself back from the dead? <laughs> kind of like me after this video. Oh my God.